Hello, I'm George Leoniak, and welcome to New Geometry. I'm super excited to be announcing my new Metatron's Cube Remastered class, Recognizing the Distortion and Drawing the Truth. So I have a short presentation here that just wants to walk through what the course contains and what it uh, discusses. So let me hop over to that presentation and we'll just walk through some of these slides. So the, uh, the main issue that it's really gonna discuss is gonna talk about uh, recognizing that these two forms, which I've discussed previously on many YouTube videos, which you may have seen, but if you haven't, there's an issue with Metatron's cube and that the icosahedron and the dodecahedron here, they don't maintain the golden proportions within the, within the form. So that means that they're gonna be distorted from the rest of the geometry here and disconnected. Now, the Metatron's Cube Remastered class is going to introduce a number of techniques that are going to produce golden ratio circles in, you know, patterns that are familiar, such as the 13 circles of the fruit of life, to produce the icosahedron and dodecahedron in a way that structurally connects to the other forms that they are embedded in, uh, or that other forms are embedded in them. Now, we're also gonna not only draw in this kind of view, but I'm gonna show you how the, uh, the, the pattern of uh, the cube will be the large hexagon on the outside, and then we'll put the golden ratio forms inside the cube with another sequence of drawings. So there's an amazing amount of drawings and content in this, and I just wanna show you what these videos contain and how they kind of relate in kind of an overarching big picture. Now, one of the key things here is that, as you see the video titles here, the only one that really mentions any of the platonic solids besides this one over here, which mentions Metatron's Cube again, video six. Um, but Metatron's Cube, in the very fact of calling it a cube, will lock your uh, perception into viewing that this is a cube and that everything will be contained in the cube. But really, sacred geometry is more about the templates and the projections that could be replicated, uh, you know, presented on the drawing pad by using different combinations of circles and lines interacting together. And this is why the titles for all these really relate to uh, the template that's going to project the form. Now, the golden fruit of life is the second video, and that's going to be a very similar outline to what Metatron's cube looks like. And I'll show you how the platonic solids are nested in there. Then there's another simple technique called the Golden Sprout of Life, probably the simplest technique within this that I'll show how that produces a compound of the icosahedron and dodecahedron and how the cube and all the other platonic solids are contained within that pattern. I also want to discuss the, uh, the Golden Seed of Life here, which I've talked a lot about on my video. We're going to do a, a drawing in here that will actually show how the platonic solids are going to be nested in the cube. So this will rotate them and we'll talk about the rhombic tricontahedron, which is a compound form of the icosahedron and dodecahedron. We'll also do that same type of drawing in a different pattern called the golden flower of life. And this is going to be the flower of life circle template. It's going to show how to draw those golden ratio forms without adding the golden ratio circles like we did previously. So this is all going to be just within the line template, which I've never shared in any YouTube videos before. That's going to be a fantastic class. I hope that you'll, that I'm sure you're going to love. Uh, then we're going to make some connections to the star cut diagram, which is a square view or two-fold symmetry drawing. Well, actually, the faces of Metatron's cube uh, contain the star cut diagram. Uh, and also the uh, Phi Yantra or the Golden Star Cut that I've talked about in some videos. We're going to show how both of those are contained on the face of the cube and really give us a picture of what Metatron's cube lines here mean um, you know, on, on the surface of the cube, what the lines are really telling us about the cube. In this one, we're going to do the Golden Vesica and do an amazing 33-line pattern, just lines and three circles that can produce all these forms from multiple projections. And in the next video, we're going to do just a single golden flower, uh, which is just the six petals of the flower of, uh, of a flower of life, one single flower. And we're going to produce this same, this same line pattern in there and show you how all the forms can be contained in there, showing how sacred geometry is really this fractal uh, relationship between these different templates at different scales 
um, it can all be contained in a single flower. And then a new golden master template, not the golden master, because all these can be master templates, but this one's going to combine some of the techniques from the previous videos and really show how the circle template and the line templates fuse together to produce um, the golden master template and reveal how all these platonic solids. And then the next evolution is showing this form here, the small stellated tricontahedron, how that is produced and uh, which we haven't discussed at all, but how this leads to an expansive geometry that is well beyond uh, what is being produced within sacred geometry at this point. So it really adds to the level of expansion in sacred geometry and in consciousness. So um, you may be thinking this is probably going to be hundreds of bucks. Well, no, not at all. I've made this super accessible. Um, and this is the course I wish I had when I got started into sacred geometry, or even if I was in advanced geometry and still drawing Metatron's cube and not really understanding how the golden ratio relates. And maybe you've seen some of my videos and you're just not sure how the, the techniques will all work out. This is the course that's going to set uh, a new bar in sacred geometry. And I've set it at a super accessible price of $27 for those nine lessons. And if you want to get a sample of uh, the first lesson of drawing Metatron's cube, I've made that completely free over at the New Geometry Courses site. So remember, that's just a start. My hope is that you will want to continue on and get the full golden, uh, get the golden revelations that are in the, uh, the further lessons, the remaining eight lessons, because it's really going to show how the platonic solids are all nested inside the cube and how this design is really just a projection of multidimensional reality, which new geometry courses gets into with the remaining courses within the curriculum. And it really focuses on the, uh, the, the circle templates and the lines interacting in ways to be projections of the higher dimensions. And that's what new geometry uh, is offering through the, the other courses on, on the site. And this is a great start into that. So uh, thanks for joining me here and checking out the uh, course, the Metatron's Cube Remastered. I hope you'll take a look at it and check it out. And I uh, hope if you have any questions about it, please feel free to contact me. Uh, much love and appreciation and uh, enjoy the course. All right, bye.